A study in Hawaii showed that in ultra running, it isn't muscle. It's mostly mental. What do you think? Yeah, I mean, yeah, I can pretty much attest to that right there. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. 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 I mean, it's true. It's not – it's – it's willpower. Like that's what ultra running is about. And I say that yeah. like I am an ultra runner, but I mean, I'm saying it based off of other people's experiences. Right. Like, everybody says it's all mental and it's so true. Like if you're doing a race, it's totally all mental. So. Um, Especially when it comes down to like loops like that and you get done and you're back at the car, you have your keys and you can easily tell them, Hey, I'm going home, put your keys in your car and you leave. Yeah. But you still got two more laps, 20 more miles to go. You're kind of vomiting laying there on the side of the trail. You're like, well, we just got to kind of finish this off. Strong mental toughness, dude. Because honestly, like obviously, physically, you weren't like physically, like you were fit, but you weren't physically fit for a 60-mile race. So it was obviously all mental. So tell us, how do you keep strong mental toughness? Like, uh, I don't know. Yeah, probably about three weeks out from the race, I kind of realized nowhere near physically ready for this. Yeah. So it kind of turned into I can't really prepare physically, but I know at mile 30 when I'm sitting down, got past the marathon, each new step's a new achievement. I'm kind of like I'm not gonna really want to get out of that chair when I'm sitting there, knowing I have a whole nother marathon to go. Yeah, all you have to do is just read the David David Goggins book before your race, and you're yeah. You're good to go. Yeah, so, you know, there's just certain little things that I did that I didn't want to do at all in training to try and go. So I'd do a 15-mile run in the morning, uh, and then I'd wake up at, like, 1 a.m., get done with homework. And I'd be like, well, you know, I don't want to go run 10 miles, but I'm going to have to. And I'd get outside and go run another 10. Just little things like that to try and build the mental toughness. Yeah, yeah I saw a lot of that in Strava. We were like, I didn't want to get up, but, yeah, do what you got to do. You need yeah. to go to like David Goggins or something like that. Lot, lot, lots of stuff like that. Yeah. Yeah. Super cool, man. Um, did you ever yell, they don't, they don't know me on the trail? Uh, no, no, I, I did not. I thought it. Yeah. A couple carry, who's going to carry the logs, you know, a couple things like that. <laughs> yeah. I feel like some people listening have no idea what we're talking about. Uh, David <laughs> Goggins is like the world's toughest man on earth. He went through Navy Soul training like th- or buds three times in a row and uh that's his thing he says is they don't know me and who's yeah. carry the logs he says they that don't know me son yeah they don't know him so um yeah just one of the little jokes we put in there for people that may not understand um but yeah we'll go ahead and go back